Hello, I'm on Holy Island. Holy Island is an island on Ireland's largest lake, Loch Dorg, and it has remnants of Christianity from the 6th century. So this is uh, St. Bridget's Church, right here. If you can imagine back in the 600, uh, 600s, 700s and so on, people gathered in this little space here, born again believers. This is the place, place, it was places like this in Ireland that Christian monks set off into Europe with the gospel after the fall of the Dark Ages. They would have lived here, studied here, worshipped here. What great history we have here in Ireland. Thirteenth century. People gathered in between these walls. Give praise and thanks to God in heaven. Think about that. The Almighty God. Hello folks, um, I'm here on Holy Island, um, Ireland's, uh, on Ireland's largest lake. Um, I'm in a church called St Mary's uh, that was built in the 1300s. As it was back then, as it is for today, Jesus Christ is Lord and Saviour. And we must be born again. And as they, as they would have read here back many, many centuries ago in Ireland, I read here today in 2012. And it's pretty much the gospel in one verse. For God so loved the world that he gave his one and only Son, that whoever believes in him shall not perish, but have everlasting life. Amen. John 3.16. And this is the same today as it was thousands of years ago. Amen. Hello, I'm in Lockgar. Not even right, it is. Yeah, Lockgar, County Limerick. This is where you'll find uh, stone circles. Maybe 3000 BC. 
you just put a large circles in a field, large circles, large stones, and put them in a circle. And he used to hang out in this circle. It was the meeting place of anyone who lived around the place. You came, you came to this stone circle and you pretty much asked what was happening. And this is like 3000 BC. You wouldn't think it, that's pretty steep. like this. There's always three of them. There's on a mountain in Galway and I just I have to pray to God and then three birds fly over. This is a good book. Lovely spot to read was in my dad's. Man. 